Was it an offensive assignment or an important lesson? A quiz that asked students who should live or die has everyone talking tonight. Eight on Your Side brought you this story first, and Candace McCowan joins us now live at the Hillsborough County School District. Candace, they are still standing by this assignment. Josh, they certainly are. Good evening. I talked to one teacher today about this assignment. She says it makes her cringe. And today I learned more about why this assignment was given out in the first place. It's racist in every form. Parent Valerie Cannell tells me she's not alone. This assignment, the lifeboat activity, brings up plenty of burning questions and asks students if a yacht was sinking, who would they save? Some of the options, the guy doctor, the girl doctor, the black guy, the white guy, the rabbi, or the minister, just to name a few. Like, who do you pick? Why is one person better than the other? Why do some get left out? But the school district isn't backing down when it comes to the assignment given at Junta Middle School, even though it's not part of the curriculum. This teacher said that the students um, were having some difficulties in class as far as working together, so he decided to do this as a team building exercise. Stephanie Baxter Jenkins from the teachers union spoke with the teacher today. He told her this was about teaching critical thinking. So I understand it makes people feel uncomfortable, but that is one of the educational points of doing it and in a world where we want our kids to gain uh, key critical thinking skills, this is one of the ways in which we do that. Asking someone who do you think should survive and who should die, that's awful. But ask child psychologist and parent Dr. Nikisha Hammond. She says if her student was given this worksheet, she'd be livid. I think it's horrible. I can't believe that the district or the school or whoever it is decided to make this kind of activity for 11 year olds and 12 year olds and middle schoolers. I think it's awful. And it doesn't sound like this assignment is going anywhere anytime soon. The district told me today that that teacher was under the impression that everyone enjoyed the assignments until he saw our story. Josh. It's quite the debate. All right, Candace McCowan live for us in Tampa tonight. Thanks.